Firstly, find the BLAST website through the Google search engine. Then, choose the most suitable of BLAST website. NCBI BLAST website might be the most suitable one. Once the NCBI BLAST is accessed, choose the Protein BLAST program. The first thing that we need is to enter the accession number or FASTA sequence of the protein interest. So, copy protein sequence of interest, then paste into the box. You have to remove other elements instead of the protein sequence. Next, enter the title of the interested protein sequence. After that, set the database category to non-redundant protein sequence. For the type of algorithm, choose PSI BLAST. Then, click BLAST. After a few seconds, the page will show the graph, alignment and the most conserved domain of protein interest. The first red line determine the most conserved domain of the protein interest. The query and subject for each line are mentioned at the below of the page. Query is the sequence that we paste, meanwhile subject is the conserved sequence of database. Furthermore, instead of non-redundant database, there is no much different we should change in order to determine the protein within the PDB database. The requirement thing that we need to change is to select the PDB database instead of other database programs. Then, click BLAST.
After a few seconds, the page will show the conserved domain of protein interest in the form of PDB. Now we are going to find out the secondary sequence of protein interest. It does include the same thing with the same website. Get the sequence ID from the alignment information. The sequence ID just involved four characteristics of passcode. Copy those sequence. For example 373C. Then, copy the sequence ID into the PDB website. The characteristics of the protein of interest will be shown up. Next. Select the sequence icon on the task bar. The secondary structure of the protein will be appeared. Then, we are going to find out the 3D structure of the protein of interest. It just includes a simple work because the 3D structure is already being viewed at the right corner. So, click the picture and the clear vision will be automatically appeared. First, open the Interproscan website through Google search. Then, copy the sequence of protein interest and paste it onto the Interproscan website. Click Submit and the functional domain of the protein sequence will be displayed. Open the Clustalex software and load the earlier database. Load the txt file. After that, click Alignment, and choose Complete Alignment. Next, save the file with D, N, D format. Open the Mega software and load the file from Clustalex file. Finally, the page will show on how the proteins of neuraminidase are ligand to each other.